In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for Javi with Instagram accounts in 2019. What is going on guys, the Cash Creator is back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for you guys to use Javi with with Instagram accounts in 2019. Don't forget, if you enjoy this video, you find it useful, please smash that like button, subscribe and share this with all your friends. Alright guys, so here is my Javi. As you can see, I've got all these accounts here, Instagram accounts and then a Twitter account as well. And I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for Javi in 2019, alright? So, the first thing that you would have to do is you would have to add your social media account, okay? So, all you have to do is click here, add profile, um, and then whichever social media account you want to gain more followers with, um, more people liking your posts, more engagement, you just simply click here. So, um, you know, if you want to add an Instagram account, you click there. I've already reached my max because I've got maximum number of accounts so I can't add one but it's really really simple for you guys to do that and I don't need to show you guys in this tutorial so once you've added your account um, and you've verified it you put a proxy on it um, the next thing that you do is you go in the information for it okay so I'm gonna click on the social profile section and then click on my account okay so this one is my tattoo page for example it's in the tattooed niche where I show different pictures of tattooed people and I get a lot of followers that way because people like seeing cool tattoos alright guys um, so um, as you can see here's the page cool tattoo art if you wanna uh, look, it, look it up alright if you don't it's up to you and then you just scroll down over here um, and the first thing that you would have to do is you click on show advanced profile settings alright so I've done that over here um, click on show advanced profile settings and as you guys can see uh, the first thing you have to do is click on enable night mode what night mode is is it basically a period a certain period of time that your Instagram account does not run okay and you need this so that Instagram doesn't think you're a robot because if you're doing things 24 hours a day Instagram is going to know you're a robot and they're going to block you or phone verify you or do something else okay so first thing you do is you, you click on enable night mode and choose a time I've got approximately 10 25 p.m. to 3 38 a.m. it's up to you guys whatever time you guys choose okay but uh, that's what I definitely do you have to do that alright guys um, you can choose which days you want to run I choose all days of the week because it gives me more time to follow people and get more followers um, next thing that you do is you delay all tools after an account is verified um, and choose approximately 2 and 20 minutes alright you must copy all of these settings um, and then check these boxes that I've shown here okay this is very important do exactly the same as me because these are the optimum settings okay so once you've checked all these boxes okay um, and then you can also check this one and put a time of 10 to 20 minutes so when temporarily blocked blocked you can suspend the tool so for example if you're following something um, but you're you know your proxy stops working for example it will stop that tool for 10 to 20 minutes alright guys um, so that is what you do first the next thing that you do is you want to put in settings for your following and unfollowing okay so that's what you need to do next alright so I'm gonna show you guys that real quick so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on this the follow button um, in tools okay you just go into tools and then click a follow button and then I'm gonna show you guys the best settings for an Instagram account okay so um, as you're probably already aware recently Instagram has started blocking loads and loads of people on Instagram you put loads of people are getting follow blocks like blocks their accounts phone verified and even permanently disabled okay so since then you have to you know do a new type of settings that I've created another video for it um, previously but I'm gonna go into a bit more detail today so the first thing that you have to do is you need to get your followers under 200 per day okay it's incredibly important if you have over 6,000 followers a month Instagram is going to block your account I promise you don't even you know wait and try it yourself just take my word for it I've done a lot of tests for this and I can confirm it so um, keep your followers below 200 a day because 
you know, 200 is the max. So once you times 200 by 30 days, it equals 6,000. So the best thing to do for these best settings is keep your um, followers under 200, okay? So it's quite simple. Um, what you want to do is you want to change this to wait, you know, between 20 and 30 minutes for each operation, each follow operation. So in one operation, for example, you're following, as you can see here, three to 14 people. And then after you follow that many people, for example, Instagram, uh, Java is going to wait 20 to 31 minutes before the next operation. OK, you can play around with these if you want, as long as your followers stay below 200. OK, but I'm showing you my best settings and they're working so far without any blocks. All right. Next thing that you do, add a delay between 20 and 50 seconds between each follow. If I change this, for example, the number of follows um, changes. So if I decrease it. So less seconds between follows, then the number of follows per day will increase. OK, so I'm going to change that to 25. And as you can see, it increased. All right. So I'm going to put it back up to 50 um, and it stays under 200. All right. Um, next thing that you're going to do is um, you're going to randomize the interval. So Instagram doesn't suspect your account of being a bot because it's always changing the time, you know, that you're following people by approximately six minutes. All right. Um, that's what you want to do next and this is your execution time it's between approximately 10 a.m to um, 12 p.m well just before 12 sorry before 12 a.m so 11 59 p.m all right so that's what you want to do next thing you want to do is you want to add a random sleep time and you want it to wait between 6 and 18 minutes okay so after you execute execute approximately 5 to 15 operations it's going to be random there's going to be a sleep time all right so that's what you want to do next. You make sure that um, days of operation are every day of the week. OK. Um, and then the final important part is over here, the follow limits. This is incredibly important. What you want to do is when you first add an account, you can't just start following 200 people per day because it's not usual. You know what you have to do is you have to start really slow. Start it at approximately 20 to 40 people following per day, and then you can increase it daily by approximately 15 people until it reaches 200. And like I said, you cannot go above 200, so put this in your settings. All right, um, I'm not going to go through the user filters because um, every person is different. So, you know, if you don't want non English users, you could skip this, for example, so you won't follow non English users. I haven't done that, but I have put user has a profile image because, you know, I don't. It might be a robot or something if it doesn't have a profile picture. All right, guys. So that's my settings for follows. Um, the next thing you're, you're going to do and then, you know, when you're ready to follow, all you have to do is you have to press that button and then it starts following. All right. Um, um, that's the best settings for it. OK. And then the follow sources. I'm not going to go through this because every account is different. So, for example, I'm in the tattoos niche um, and I'm following, you know, people that use these hashtags tattooed related hashtags or followers of tattooed related accounts like this one it's got a lot of followers so i'm following people in that niche all right and you guys can do do that all yourselves i'm not going to go through it the next thing i'm going to talk about is unfollowing all right this is another important one you want to you know be unfollowing approximately the same amount of people that you're following so if you follow 200 you know you can unfollow 200 as well all right so first things first what you want to do is unfollow after a minimum of three and three and a half days so after you follow someone three to three and a half days later it's going to unfollow that person all right um and you know you want to wait between 15 and 24 minutes before starting an operation again you just play around with this till it's approximately the same amount around 200 yeah so just a similar amount slightly above the number of people you're following so as you can see i'm following around um, 195 per day and I'm unfollowing around 202 okay guys so you can see my settings over here um, unfollow between 2 and 7 with a uh, delay of approximately this much 18 to 59 settings and you can change the execution time if you will all right um, <clears throat> okay so you could just pause the video and then copy my settings because these are the best settings for Javi all right um, again, you want to add a random sleep time after executing a number of operations and you can copy this in. Then the next thing that you want to do is change the unfollow limits. All right. Um, <coughs> you want to be following approximately um, 
20 to 30 per day because you've got to start slow and then increase by around 15 until it reaches 200 uh, or just over 200 all right um, again the user filters you can choose that yourselves you know everyone's different you know I, I like to keep people engaged with me so people that are engaging I don't want to unfollow them all right um, then the next tool is the like tool okay this is another great tool for you guys to use that can increase engagement because for example if you see a popular page in your likes for example a tattooed page um, you know which it has a lot of followers for example likes one of your pictures you're gonna be like oh who's this you know who's this account and then you're gonna click on it and you're gonna see it has nice pictures and then you're gonna follow it so this is a very important tool um, and here are the best settings okay optimum are approximately again around 200 okay so you want to wait between 10 and 15 minutes before starting a new operation um, you know yeah like between three to six posts per operation um, and then between each like there needs to be a short delay of 20 to 40 seconds all right you can choose your execution time and then you can add random sleep times as well over here just copy these settings exactly um, and then you can change your like limits as well okay so you can decrease it you know start low so for example again 20 to 40 um, increase it by small amounts until it reaches the max all right so these are the like settings and again you have sources so sources is basically the where the stuff that you want to like so for example again i'm liking posts of people that are using these hashtags tattooed model tattoo style um, and then i'm also liking posts of followers of a really popular page okay so that is um, the three most important parts of Java. okay following people you know and then unfollowing this gives you followers because when you follow someone then they're going to look at your page and probably follow you back unfollowing so it doesn't look like you're a robot by just following loads of amount loads of amounts of people you need to start unfollowing and then the like tool these are probably the most important tools in Javi. in another video i'm going to go through slightly less important tools like the comment tool um, the direct message tool and other tools okay um and there's also campaigns which you can use to post different pictures on Javi. So, you know, you can steal pictures from other people, but, you know, other people's content and then repost those. It's another great tool. All right, guys. So that is the end of my video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like, leave a comment and subscribe to the Cash Creator. Peace out, guys.